Let's talk about a quarterback who I've been critical of, and you a couple of weeks ago said something that I played two or three times. You said with Aaron Rodgers, not that it was a, a red flag, but th that he was different on film. So he goes against Denver, which has very good corners. At least they look good to me on television. And oh, they yeah. Have, and they have a pass rush. Is sometimes Aaron Rodgers Aaron Rodgers' biggest liability in that game? Well, that game is – look, they, they were obviously poor all around, and it's hard to put that game solely on Aaron Rodgers. Their receivers could not get open against the predominant man coverage of the Broncos, and they run what we call isolation routes, individual routes, independent routes. There's not a lot of concepts where receivers work off one another, and their receivers could not win. They could not get open. But I've talked to you for a, a while now, and – and the reality is when you watch Aaron Rodgers, and it takes nothing away from his performances over the years, but he's not truly a rhythm player, Colin. He's kind of an offbeat player, an off-rhythm player. He's more like a jazz beat. He's a second reaction player. Uh, and very often there are throws that are there within the rhythm of the play and the timing of the play, and he doesn't make those throws. Now, he might move around and then make another throw, but there are times against really good defenses where that doesn't work. It's tough to be consistent that way against higher-level defenses.